what is up YouTube yes we are back with another great video if you are subscribed to the channel thank you so much if you're new to this hit that notification bell so you can get each and every new video so yes we have a great one today but first off I just to give you a background real fast on um, my love for Reebok so basically you know I love Reebok I love a lot of the shoes from the 90s like the Reebok pumps Omnizone 2's Shack Attacks um, the Reebok question the Reebok answers love them shoes Reebok black tops there's a lot of shoes that I love Reebok um, What's that one? I can't even think about it, but I love them. I know what it is. <laughs> Classics, all of them, man. Club C's, you name it, I love them, man. Reebok has some quality products with some great materials, and they do a great job, guys. And they have some beautiful designs and ideas, and they're very creative. In the 90s, Reebok did rule the shoe game, man. I'm telling you, man. You know, everyone thinks Jordan, Nike ruled everything. Reebok was the king at one point. Now, um, I do have a great one today. This shoe is actually a hybrid and a brand new shoe, new release to the uh, shoe game. It's called the Reebok Insta Pump Fury Zone. Now you guys know about the Reebok Insta Pump Furies. They're more of like a, a low top uh, Insta Pump, you know, and that shoe is familiar to everyone. And then also, this is a hybrid of the Reebok Omnizone 2, Reebok uh, Pump Omnizone 2. So it's a hybrid of those two shoes. Now this particular shoe, they have a few different colorways um, to offer, but this one is in the, um, obviously the colorway of the Omnizone 2s, the Pump Omnizone 2s, which is called, you know, also nicknamed the D Browns, because famously D Brown wore this in the dunk contest. He did that put his uh, forearm over his eyes as he's dunking so it's basically a no look dunk <laughs> you know what I'm saying he flew through the air uh, with no sight in scene and dunked that ball with veracity and creativity and just showmanship and people love that dunk it's so famous it's iconic and you know he wore the Omnizone 2's in this beautiful OG colorway so this shoe comes in that OG colorway um, now this shoe is laceless as you can see no laces in the shoes at all we have no laces which is I think is dope okay you have a Reebok um, vector right there under the um, the Reebok pump itself as you can see um, it has like a it comes here as a support system right here for your foot um, up into like towards your ankle and the top of your foot um, it does have another vector logo right there it has um, the um, Reebok uh, performance uh, midsole right here and I think it's a plate I'm not exactly sure um, I forgot what this is called I apologize um, I do apologize I cannot remember what it was called but um, in the ankle part right here you have some nice quality leather right here as you can see with a oversized vector that reminds you of the 90s on this part it says okay so this says okay a a violent okay so this is a noun of fury a vi a, a violent expression of energy and on this side it says fury right here which is dope guys look at this fury on this side right here so and this uh, strap is for obviously support and performance now let's see the pump does work I tried it out and let's pump it up I know you guys want to see this it does pump up which it gives you as you can see look it's pumping up right here so this gives you extra support through the foot you know and you see how it's pumped up now it looks actually a lot cooler like that because is it more like a design like a 3d look which I love this design it's so iconic like I said from the Omnizone 2 and the shape of the shoe is from the Insta Pump Fury so as you can see that the shape of the shoe itself is from the Insta Pump Fury I give you an over, overview of this real fast so you can see guys 
Like I said that, um, look at the leather quality on this right here. That's kind of cool. Like a uh, basketball type of um, d um, colorway and the leather looks really nice. This is Reebok in there. This is, the materials are mesh, like nylon, like I said with some um, rubber and the uh, leather on the back. Um, as you can see right here on the toe box, really dope. Look at the traction on the bottom. This is crazy. It's very plain with just a vector in the middle, but looks like it would be some good traction. Right guys? I would think so. Um, let's, uh, let's take a look at the actual um, particulars on the hang tag. It says Insta Pump Fury Zone. It says basketball for basketball. It's a basketball shoe. Um, it is my size, size 11. Okay, guys. So um, these, I've seen in other videos, it says uh, go up a half a size, or you can even be true to size. It's not going to be a tight fit, it says. So, But let's release the valve now. As you heard that, instant pump, bang. So what do you guys think of this um, Reebok Insta Pump Fury Zones? It's a hybrid of two of my favorite shoes. And I think it's a great shoe. I, I love that it's laceless. It does look like a 90s shoe. So you know I love my 90s shoes. Um, as much as you can see, boom, the answer's right there. So we get the answers right there, brought out our answers. The Reebok question, OGs, blue toes, right there. Bang, man. And then we have, you know what else I brought out, guys? I'm gonna show y'all real fast. Bang! My Shaq um, attacks, and it's the Superman Shaq attacks. I have this video out um, as well, guys, if you wanna take a look at this video. It's in the playlist, the Reebok um, DC um, Superman Shack Attacks. And I want to give you a, like a size comparison of both of these so you can see how tall the shoe is because the Reebok Shack Attacks is one of the tallest shoes. And look, the tongue is a little bit taller, but look at this. The back of the ankle right here, it goes up a little higher uh, than the Shack Attacks. That is crazy because the Shack Attacks is a tall shoe. So this gives you a, a nice little um view of how tall the shoe is going to be now as you can see the shack attack tongue is a lot taller not a lot taller just a little bit taller than that so i love this insta pump fury um and i can't even say the name the insta pump fury zones i think it's a great hybrid shoe of two of the best reebok shoes out and I think Reebok did a great job with this shoe. I love these. I uh, love this OG colorway in this beautiful design. And guys, if you enjoyed this video, like I said, go ahead and hit that notification bell. Um, leave me some comments. Let me know what you think about this shoe today, or any of my previous videos, or any of my work. And you know, thank you so much, guys. And. YouTube, I hope you love this Reebok presentation. I am out.